Hey guys, back with another video. Um, I just want to do uh, show you how the raid bosses work in this game. Um, as you can tell, that guy just came around and one shotted that boss level four. Um, so I'll close it, but I'll show you guys here in a second. Another one should pop up. I've only been attacking the ones I've been scouting, uh, just so I can stay in the event. But um, as you can tell, here's a level 2 Steel Sea Witch. Um, if I want to attack her, it's going to use one key. Or I can boost my damage five times, to, uh, but it uses three keys. Um, she just died, so we'll go ahead and close her out. Um, but yeah, I've been playing the raid bosses for a little bit. It's pretty fun. Uh, rewards aren't great, but these are low-level bosses. But here's one found by me. Didn't even really do anything to find her. I just <laughs> found her. But um, you get fire medals, you get five, you get gold, you get trophies towards the event. Um, you get another key if you scout, another key if you finish the attack. So... I'm going to go ahead and attack the boss with one key, and it's just like in the uh, normal missions, line up the gems, she's water so I want earth, but I don't really have the earth, so we'll just go ahead and start attacking her. Another guy will come along and... Attack her, so I'm gonna try to attack her as much as I can. As you can tell, she just did a good amount of damage. That was a very low attack. I'm not very strong, <laughs> so. Yeah. And here's another combo. Hopefully, I can get the most damage award, but MVP award. It's kind of like Hellfire when you can do the raid bosses and get MVP and everything. Um, MVP was awarded to the Green Arrow. Uh, finisher was the Green Arrow. I got the pumpkin key to find for the finding the boss. So, but yeah, I only did around five thousand damage. He did around nine thousand. And then we had another guy do around four thousand. But I'll claim my awards. And so I got eight keys you can see right on the top. Um, I'm currently ninth right now out of the Squires, which is the low <laughs> level players. I guess it's good. I don't know. Um, you can see the rewards that you get. If you place third, you get a four star hero, you get gems, you get gold. Second place. And in first place, you get this exclusive fire mage. Um, she's pretty good actually. She does 200% of her attack and 600% of her recovery for two turns. Um, I'll go ahead and show you what it's like in the legend category. <laughs> First place this guy has f almost 43 million points. He's got a pretty OPS deck I'm guessing. This guy right here, there, it's like Hellfire with the elites. Um, he does, you can see the 10x on the Headless Horseman. He basically does 10 times damage so to the bosses. So I'm definitely looking forward to progressing in this game so I can get damage like that. But first place reward, you get this mage right here. 1,000 attack, only at level 1. It's crazy. Good health, good recovery. Plus her skills a lot does a lot more. She attacks all enemies for 300% of her attack and 900% of the recovery for two turns. So pretty OP as hell. <laughs> but yeah, um, see what the raids looking like here. That guy just did one shot on the boss. I'd like to do a one shot on the boss. But yeah, I just want to show you guys what the raid was like.
Um, here's an event store here where I can get more pumpkin keys. Uh, only five in the 17 hours. It restocks in 17 hours. The event ends in six days, so I guess they're seven day events. And I can get nine pumpkin keys for 300 gems. So, um, you also have the option to get heroes. I have 85 coins right now, and then to get a three star hero or up, it's 100. Four star hero is 250, and then you got this Deep Moss Jaguar. I don't know, maybe it'll be worth it. It has very low attack. Pretty high health though, but it heals for 400% of recovery and team is immune to damage this turn. So any kind of damage done to me, I guess I'm immune to it. There's a lot going on in this game. It's definitely a lot involving in other games I've played, so. But... Alright, well, I just wanted to show you guys the raid bosses. Give this game, you know, try it out. You know, it's worth a shot. And, um, see how, see how much this game grows. Like I said, I don't really care for how grindy it is, but I'm hoping to progress as I keep playing it, so. Alright, thanks. Thanks, you guys, for watching.